nomad's dream beyond boundaries and borders hello everyone welcome back to cinema for a cause presents nomad's dream i am dipankita your host and dost taking you to amazing vacations every day our today's guest is miss arathrika guha arathrika is a student of the bss school which is formerly known as baligan shiksha sadan she is a multi talented girl she is a state level table tennis player and not just that she also holds a position in the council of her school she is going to take us for a new trip today to the location of her choice so why are we waiting let's go for today's trip with arathrika nomad's dream beyond boundaries and borders I want to share my experience of my visit to Aurangabad. I went to Aurangabad last December. After going to Aurangabad, we first visited the Shirdi temple. I saw many people devoting themselves to Sai. I also prayed my offerings and I came back from the Sai temple. After coming back from the Sai temple, we went to the Ellora Caves. The Ellora Caves, one of the most significant and one of the most important architectural place in the world. The Ellora Caves was constructed in 600 CE to 1000 CE under the Rashtrakuta this cave is the largest monolithic cave or the excavation of the world the Koilash temple excavation also portrays the features and sculptures depicting the gods goddesses of mythologies found in the Vaishnavism as well as in Hindu i was also very enthralled by seeing the bodhi satwas or the structures which were found in the ellora cave The Ellora Cave consists of many more other structures like the Vaishwavite, the Shaivite, and the Buddhist. I could feel the smell of the manuscripts and the chaityas, which were the assembly halls of the Ellora Cave. Inside the cave of the Ellora, then I was so enthralled and I was so happy to see that it felt like as if I became a part of the history itself. After visiting the Ellora Caves, we went to Biviki Makwara. Biviki Makwara was made by Aurangzeb in the the memory of his first wife dilras banu begum it resembled the taj mahal and it was made in the center of the garden and i will always remember my trip here and it has become one of the most important trips of my life and i will remember it and keep it intact in the memory of my books of tours thank you Thanks a lot to Arathrika for sharing this amazing experience with us. And now it's your turn. Do you want to take part in Nomad Stream? Then do WhatsApp me in nine zero seven double three double one zero nine four, or you can also email me at dipankita dot ghosh one triple nine at the rate gmail dot com. I hope that all of you are enjoying the episodes of Nomad Stream, and you are liking to go for traveling with us. So. Let us know your feedback in the comment section. Keep watching Nomad Stream. Keep supporting us. Have a good day ahead.